People think Californians are just a bunch of dreamers. There have been plenty of tourist adverts for the likes of New York, Florida and California, but now the USA as a whole is hoping you'll visit more of the country. It uses the passion point of music. People arrived from many lands, bringing their own language and song. The film, voiced by Morgan Freeman, features Grammy-nominated singer Aloe Black. The director, Greg McGillivray, he was the perfect fit. You know, he has the story that we were looking for. The, the background, parents were from Panama, they were emigrated to the United States, they brought their music with them. So Aloe grew up with Caribbean-style music, then got into hip-hop and all kinds of other styles, and now he's into jazz. And, in the pop and rock, and, and it's, um, it's kind of the perfect subject for Aloe Black because he is kind of a renaissance musical genius. Aloe's music also provides the soundtrack for the IMAX film that can be shown on giant screens. Well, I think my music brings a, a lively, energetic feel of the different genres that are depicted in the film. You know, I've studied uh, hip hop, blues, jazz, and rock, and I bring all of that background to the film. Musical roots of America are super important to feature in the film because all of these forms of music began here. And this unique experiment of democracy that's given us freedom of expression has led to this music spreading across the world and inspiring musicians and artists everywhere. So what's the vision behind the campaign? This film is about the collision of cultures from all over the world. And when those cultures came to America, they created new musical styles and, and a way to express yourself. I really hope that the people, the audience members, get how that creative expression is something that's so American that we can't lose it. And it's that acceptance and that tolerance of other people that really makes us wonderful as people. Music is a, is a unifying phenomenon. Music is a universal language. And I believe because we have uh, some of the best music in the world and have created the genres that everybody else is playing, America is the place to experience music. The organization behind the film hopes we'll experience that music in person. The mission of Brand USA is to inspire and welcome visitors, global travelers, to come to the, to, the, to the entirety of the USA. We know the best way to do that, the best way to inspire people to come, is through great storytelling, uh, great entertainment. And so we've really kind of taken the role of the leadership role, really, to becoming more than just a destination marketing organization, but to become an entertainment company. That's just the, you know, the, the vision that we have. Video in all its forms is a major part of Brand USA's strategy. We know that destination marketers need to become entertainment companies. We're kind of leading the way in that. We do that on the giant screen, but we also do it through things like our, our streaming TV channel, Go USA TV, which really we need to have because the stories of America are so broad, so diverse, that we need a number of channels to be able to tell them all. This is one big welcome. The TV service is streamed across Roku, Apple TV and Amazon. It's hoped the content will keep people hooked with films like America's Musical Journey. We've screened it for stakeholders and for the public in a few areas and um, the, the reaction is amazing. We know that the films work, we know that they inspire and we know that the same will hold true for America's Musical Journey. There have been plenty of headlines in the press backed up by statistics from the US Department of Commerce showing tourist numbers in decline. European visitors were down 10%, even visits from neighboring Mexico were down 7%. Some analysts point at the strength of the dollar, others suggest it's a backlash against President Trump's views on foreigners and immigration. Tom Garzilli takes a different view. We feel strongly that, that travel transcends politics. There are flux, fluctuations in, in the tourism arrivals, um, but they're on a constant increase. And while some of the numbers are down, spending in international, from international travel is up. We'll continue to grow, and we know that tourism to the U.S. will continue to grow.
Hello, I'm James Wright. Thanks for watching Marketing Media Money. To check out more online videos, just click on the boxes and don't forget to subscribe to the CNBC Life channel at the bottom of the screen.